As with every reality show, Bravo's hit offering Mary to Medicine has seen a shakeup during its nine seasons. So what have some of the most popular cast members been up to since quitting reality TV? We've got it all covered for you. OG Mariah Huck, who also donned the hat of executive producer, was the reason why the hit show even came into existence, as she initially proposed the idea to Bravo. After the first two editions, she appeared on a recurring basis and made her full-time comeback only in the sixth installment. Ahead of the season 8 premiere, she threw shade at Bravo, saying her contract was not renewed by the network, and declared her intentions to file a lawsuit against Bravo, accusing the network and its producers of breach of contract, breach of joint venture agreement, failure to prevent harassment, and retaliation. In an appearance on the Reality with the King podcast last May, she revealed her decision to not move forward with the lawsuit. But it seems like things worked out for the best anyway, and she has been keeping busy with many other passion projects. Sharing her plans, she said, I'm opening up a new shared co-work space with the building I bought a few years ago. I have a media space coming over 6,000 square feet in downtown McDonough. I'm working on a script. I started as a writer, and I'm getting back to that. Mariah, who's Dr. Aiden's wife, never misses the chance to gush about her family and pay homage to them, especially her children. Whether it be her teenage daughter, Lauren Taylor, starting a new and exciting chapter of entering adulthood and joining Spelman College, or her son Ethan, turning 16, the proud mother always documents her children's biggest milestones. While she was a leading cast member for only three editions, ending her stint in the fourth edition, Lisa Nicole Cloud definitely made an impression on fans. Sadly, she had to defend her marriage with Dr. Darren Noggles, amid intense speculation that the latter was unfaithful to his wife, which he denied. It seems being out of the spotlight really helped the couple, who celebrated their 15th wedding anniversary last July, to come back together and work out their issues. Last year was a big one for her children, Amira and DJ too. Amira, who's an aspiring beauty queen, participated in the Miss Teen Earth pageant, while DJ attended a big event of his high school life, his prom. On the professional front, Lisa Nicole is the CEO of several successful companies, including Elite Medical Associates, MAGL Diagnostic Laboratories, Elite Marketing Strategies, and the Women's Empowerment Network. This February, she launched her Je ne sais quoi collection at the New York Fashion Week. Dr. Contessa Metcalf, who joined the ladies in the fifth installment, exited the series after a four-year run because she wanted to focus on her family and her medical practice. During season eight, her marital challenges with her husband, Dr. Scott, played out on camera. By the reunion, their relationship was so estranged, Contessa even filed for a legal separation at one point. But since then, they have made big strides in their relationship, and their marriage is back on track. Dr. Contessa made it a point to denounce the idea that reality television can destroy marriages. In fact, she said it did the opposite for hers, saying Mary to Medicine saved her marriage. The couple shares three children, daughters Lauren and Layla, and son Landon. And the doctor is expanding her horizons and excelling in different fields. Last October, she took to Instagram to post a video featuring photos from her first fitness competition, which she ended up winning. She's also focused on her goal of becoming the Surgeon General of the United States. Anila Saja, who was part of the main lineup in the 8th and 9th season, will not return to the show in order to pursue other opportunities. She explained that while she will be taking a break, she won't be gone for long, and added that she's been working on some projects that will give her the opportunity to continue sharing her journey. She will be diverting all her time on her hair-related business venture called Private Label, as it's one of the projects she's very passionate about. Anila and her husband, Kiran, who celebrated their 10th wedding anniversary in March, have two children together, daughter Ariana and son Avir. The family of four is proud of their Indian heritage and loves celebrating festivals like Diwali and Holi. Thank you for watching our video. Don't forget to like, share, and comment. Subscribe to our channel for more great content.